Hi, welcome to Awkward Hamster. Today I'll be doing an unboxing video of a video baby monitor I got from Amazon. The brand name is Infant Optics. The model version is DXR-5. I got it for $100. And one of the reasons I got it was because supposedly it retails for $300. But Amazon is currently selling for $100. I didn't feel like buying a summer infant monitor, video monitor. It seems like summer is by far the most popular one. And those go for over $200. So I figured I might as well give this one a shot. So let me open this up. That's a nice big screen. Let's see, over here it says the screen turns off automatically when the uh, Vox is on. The power button's here. I'm not sure what this is. Get the DC, volume down, volume up. Seems like a little clip over here. And here's the uh, brightness controls. Is it a belt clip. And it looks like it accepts proprietary battery. Here's that battery. Oh, and here's the, uh, I guess this is the strap for here. And two screws. Now let's open up this side. Here we have the actual camera. Here we have a power button. This looks like an LED light indicator. Here's a pairing button. And the DC input six volts. Here's an AC adapter. This AC adapter is for the camera unit. So here I have all the items laid out. Starting from this side, this is actually the mount for the camera. This way, the camera can have the viewing angle downward towards the crib. Then we have the AC adapter for the camera. Over here we have the monitoring, the battery, cord, strap, and another AC adapter. I'll take a look at the manual later. But first thing we'll do is plug it in and see how it works. So right now the room is pretty well lit. I also cover up the Foscam just so that I get no um, extra light coming from the Foscam's uh, night vision LEDs. Turns out this P button is the pairing button, so if I have other cameras, I could pair it with this monitor unit. So in a well-lit room, the quality's not bad. 
I actually like the size of the screen, a 2.5 inch screen. And I'm going to turn off the light. Night vision came on automatically. I can lower the brightness if I want. Or increase it. And I can also adjust the volume. I read through the manual and you are able to turn off the infrared as well as the standby feature. The uh, Fox standby feature. So turn, to turn off the infrared you press the minus button on the contrast and the minus button on the volume at the same time. So right now it's set to auto. Let's turn on. And now it's off. And to turn off the Vox, press the plus button on the contrast and the plus button button for the volume. So now the voice activation is on and the voice activation is off. The benefit about this is if you want the screen on constantly you can just, just turn the voice activation off. If the voice activation, the Vox is turned on after three minutes of silence the screen will automatically turn off and it will wake up if the camera senses um, sound that's 60 de decibels or more, that's pretty low bar. Just about like a clap or anything. The baby just um, sneezes, that's 60 decibels. Another thing is the clip back here. If you press down on it and you just pull it up, it locks into place. It's now a kickstand. So that's actually quite handy. Now for some pros and cons. I'm going to first cover the cons. The biggest con was is that this operates on a 2.4 gigahertz uh, wireless technology. So there is a chance that this will interfere with your house phone that runs on the same frequency or it might interfere with your wireless network at home. The second con is it's advertised to have a lithium ion battery and yet there's no battery meter like I can't tell how much power is left in here which is strange for, lithium -ion, for, for a product that carries lithium ion battery now for the pros I like how the camera came with a stand and it has a nice range for me to um, adjust and monitor the child the microphone is pretty sensitive Another pro is I like how I can pair up to a total of four cameras with this one video monitor. Um, the, another pro is the LEDs over here, they're not too bright. So if, if it's pitch dark in the room and I'm trying to sleep, these LEDs won't bother me. I love the size of the screen, a 2.5 inch screen. I like how I can choose to turn the uh, voice activation monitoring on or off. With it on, it goes to a standby in three minutes when it doesn't detect any, no any sound and it automatically, automatically wakes up, which is great too. I also love how there's a kickstand here. So that will be very handy. And the biggest pro is the price. It's $100 on Amazon.com. They say that the retail price is $300, but I was able to purchase it for 100 so for this price, and it works, unlike my last video monitor, this, this, I'll definitely give, give, give this product two thumbs up. Well, thank you for watching this unboxing and review of the Infant Optics DXR-5 Video Baby Monitor. If you have any questions, comments, suggestions, please feel free to send to me. Thanks for watching Walker Hamster. Bye.